Mm. Tea, sir? Ah, yes. Thank you, Geoffrey. Lovely weather, isn't it, today, sir? It's very British, isn't it? Yes, sir. Your troubles, Geoffrey. Thank you, sir. You know, you know, there's nothing better than a good cup of British tea. It's not really my bonus, just an extra. Who I expect to get that five pound back from. Extras. You know, we Brits have always had a way of doing things, from an all-day breakfast to fish and chips. The main one being, we all drink tea and eat crumpets. I'm not saying that's wrong. I mean, tea is the liquid of the heavens, after all. You know, I've heard something about Americans. They don't put milk in their tea and they leave the tea bag in there. That's just... Bless me. You know, it makes me wonder. Do Americans live up to some of the stereotypes we Brits have? Could use some biscuits. Now I find the magic of TV, I'm in a different room, wearing different clothes. I'm gonna speak to some people and ask them some questions. What comes to mind when I say American? Patriotic. Uh, Eagles. Yeah, definitely. It's definitely the Stars and Stripes. How many states are there in America? 52, is it not? Yeah, I think it's... Yeah. There's 50. 50? 50. 50. I swear it's 52. It's 50. I'm sure there's <laughs> We did our research, it's 50. There was 52 <laughs> at one point. What kind of foods do Americans eat? Fast foods, burgers. Lots of fast food. Do you associate their food with obesity, basically? Big portions. Anything <laughs> over this size. Everything's big in America. Can you say the Pledge of Allegiance? No. I <laughs> pledge, alle ple pledge allegiance to the flag. That's all I can remember. Of the United States of America. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> can you do an American accent? Um, I definitely can. I'm doing one right now. I mean... Yeehaw. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well... Thanks for the talk, guys. See you later. Now, it's time to go over to our representative American and see what he's got to say on these topics. UK to America. UK coming in. We Brits have this stereotype implanted in our mind that all Americans are fat and lazy. You can't walk a few blocks without seeing a fat American. How true is this? Well, we do have a lot of fat people, but it's not really, like, like extremely everywhere like even though obesity levels are apparently really high here i don't really see a lot of fat people like fat people like you might see a couple people with like chubs on them and then you'll see really fat people but overall it's just um it's kind of a 50 not nah, not even a 50 50 chance like it depends on where you are yeah in america like here there's there's a lot of fat people but just not everywhere they're kind of in a general area. Everyone in America owns a good home, How true is this? Uh, a lot of Americans own a gun. Some Americans don't, but most of us do. And, uh, yeah, you know, the reason that we're able to, you know, do this and everything is, of course, because uh, whenever we became uh, independent from you guys and stuff, we made that law so we could, uh, you know, revolt against any government that would try to overtake us. And uh, we still have the law for the same reasons. And also, then, then some. We, we, we love our guns. Do you have something to say to we Brits across the pond about the stereotypes we've got about Americans? Do you have some about us? Uh, yeah. Um, I remember whenever I was little, and uh, we used to impersonate you Brits, and, uh, and well, anyone across the seas from us, like us, you know, little children. Uh, we were like about eight, eight years. No, not even eight. Uh, from second grade up until eighth grade, uh, I uh, had wait no, not eighth grade. Seventh grade, I had the stereotype that was implanted in my mind and my friend's mind that all of you drank tea. Uh, all of you were very polite all of the time, and that you all wore top hats. Uh, also, I, I think uh, I was also told that all of you like 
believed in witches and that you were all like Catholics or Protestants. Good job. Well, looks like these Americans are just confused about stereotypes of Brits as we are about Americans. Looks like I've got to go to America and sort these Yanks out once and for all. Jeffrey, to America, please. Yes. See you later. Still on that five pound back, by the way. Still buy my dinner. <laughs>